You know, I, I would look at players and I, and I knew that they were great players, but the first thing I didn't think of was how good of a player they were. I was thinking of, man, this guy's got millions of dollars. The first thing I saw when I came into the facility was a player's parking lot, and I saw all these cars, and I was like, well, this is a little bit different than college. <laughs> in college, people were riding their bikes and their mopeds and the hand-me-down cars that they got from their family, and you know, so it was definitely a, a big change when you saw the parking lot. Bentleys, Aston Martins, um, crazy exotic cars I've never even heard of. My family's always been pretty financially stable. Um, I was able to be raised in a, a really nice town with a nice house, and we always had really nice things. Um, but then it was in college that um, when throughout the recession, my, my dad owned his own company, and uh, he lost it. And we lost a lot of money, and things were really tight. And I remember certain times where we're like, we weren't sure how we were going to pay this bill and how we were going to pay that bill. and you know, you know, so that was when I knew, like, man, if there was a way I could make it in the NFL, I would love to be able to support my family. And um, so th I think that was a big motivational factor for me, like, throughout camp. Like, when I thought times were getting tough and I was like, man, can I do this? I was like, man, you have to do this because if you can somehow make it, like, you could, you know, set up your family for the, you know, maybe for the rest of their lives.